Didn't didn't Philbo say he lost uh, his clo chum, I need your What? What do you need? Grave importance. Oh. You see, my seismic readings have been off the charts today, and I fear something terrible is happening just off the coast. Oh. Chandler and I are headed to Simmering Springs to investigate, and I'd be greatly reassured if you could join us. Sure, Sprinklebot, let's go. Splendid! Meet us there whenever you get the chance. In the meantime, we have preparations to make. Chandler, ready the sunscreen! <laughs> Ooh, interesting. Sure. We'll go to Simmering Springs. That's over here. Mm -hmm. Wait, that one has a hat! He's wearing a hat! Oh my gosh, get him! How do I get him? What does he like? What does he like? What does he like? He likes... He fears a crap. Dang it, I need to get that hat! Okay, 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 okay. Chocolate, 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 chocolate. How the heck do they change the controls? How do I pull out my kit? Ah, oh, here it is, okay. Chocolate. You like chocolate. Yes, 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 yes. Get that chocolate, you piece of crap! More. Yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Feed, feed. No, 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 get chocolate. Chocolate. Get the chocolate, you hack! No, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. Yes! I got the hat! I got the hat, I got the hat, I got the hat! New snack hat! Yay! I got Snorby's cap, let's go. You got a snack hat. Visit Gamble's Barn Snacks where to put hats on your donate box snacks. Oh! <laughs> Banana is yumsies, but I am not yumsies. There's nothing smug about it, Drew, but yes, water areas have peaceful music. It is true. We need to keep an eye out for bug snacks that have hats. Because we can unlock some hats. So we found Snorpy's cap. Oh, there they are. Let me get some chocolate and then we'll be on our way. Manny. I'm mad he won't show us the bungers. Dude, we're about to go to the new area. We're going to see some different bug snacks. Let's go check that out. That's what's exciting. Oh, yeah. I always wanted to have a beach party. Need me to sunscreen your back, Snorp Dog? No, no, no need, Chandler. <laughs> I'm well protected. I can tolerate the horrible sun for at least a few <laughs> minutes. You sure? I could check if you missed a spot. Ooh. Uh, 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 best to keep our wits oh. about ourselves. This seismic event could you happen sprinkle any moment. Oh, oh, oh. What's going on? Bro, what was that? They're not usually this intense. An anomaly, to be sure. But it ended surprisingly quick. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. It's a new island, dog! We gotta go over there! Uh, must we? Uh, um, yes, of, of course. Uh, but, but surely this job is bigger <laughs> than the three of us. We need to form a miniature expedition. A gathering of our finest scientific minds. Of course, that means Triffany and... Floofty. <laughs> oh, get Shelda, too! Shelda? Well, she's hardly qualified. You said you want the finest minds, and Shelda's loaded with <laughs> wisdom. Bam! Team assembled! Oh, I suppose she is an herbalist, and the closest thing we have to a doctor without Eggabel around. Very well. Tell Triffany, Floofy, and Shelda to come to the beach. Chandler and I will stay here to prepare a way across. Get hype! Hype! Exclamation mark hype in chat, baby. All right, all right, all right. I want to decorate a snack at town with a hat. I want to see what I could do. <laughs> Snacks fall. Where are you going with this? I, I get so insecure when you put a smug next to a message, you know. <laughs> I'm doing good, Arda. It's good to see you. Hope you're doing well. Bungers are more important. We're gonna find a big bunger. That's the, even more important. An herbalist. Oh, it should be a herbalist. You're right. It's wrong. Bro, what the heck? You were out. at the beach. You're what? Bobo told me you were living here, and I thought, you know what this place needs? Wall. I mean, you're right. It's my bad for not finishing it in the first place, though. I was gonna have it ready in time for you, but then all that stuff happened. This is so awkward. You're but supposed to be at the beach. Later, Chandler gets the job done. Enjoy your walls, dog. 
This is what happens when you like have already beaten the game and then they add an update that causes a lot of encounters to occur after a bunch of in-game events are completed. <laughs> they all start happening at once. So he was over there like, oh yeah, we're going to build a way across this island. Go back to town and uh, get these people to come up. And they're like, oh hey, yeah, while you were gone, I <laughs> completed your home. <laughs> uh, Triffany, let's go. Mm -hmm. Bed made for dragon. Yeah, I could curl up in there. Do you want to join our expedition? Oh, you better believe I do. Islands don't just pop into being every day, you know. I got no business left here, so I'll go on ahead and meet you on the beach. Mm. Shelda. Well, let's do it in order. Where's Floofty? Ah, there you are. You want to join? Mm -hmm. So an unknown piece of geography has erupted from the ocean, unexplained and unstable, likely to sink again at any moment. So of course I'm going. I will gather my equipment. <laughs> All right. It basically like it's extremely dangerous and mysterious. So yeah, let's go. <laughs> Look who's go. talking, no, Mister. It's all you make me blushing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're quite the looker yourself. A pet, 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 pet. <laughs> I'm no one's pet. I am a strong independent. I, I take it back. I, I I take everything nice back that I said. I'm a strong independent dragon. I'm no pet. I just don't have like a proper bed yet. So that's the comfiest one. So I'm going to use it. But thank you for the lurk, Arda. I ain't a good boy. You're asking me? <clears throat> well, of course. Your need for guidance is great. Despite the peril... One will show you the path. I thought we were past this. And that scary little island. If it's what I think it is, there's something there I need to see. Dude, you were literally just yeah. in the bathroom while I'm doing exactly what you asked me to do. Why didn't you just do it yourself? Yeah. Oh, the hat! Don't forget the hat. I wanted to try. Even Snorpy's here! What the heck? What happened to... Oh, yeah, we're going to make a path oh, while you go back to town and round up these people. All right, let's make him wear a hat. <gasps> Dress. <laughs> <Just put it. laughs> That's adorable. Strong independent man! Not woman! Man! Strong independent butts. <laughs> he's got a little, it's like a little beret thing. It's adorable. He's like, he's like the paper boy. If your paper boy turned out to be a french fry spider, wouldn't that make you more likely to subscribe to that service? Fine, you wanted a bunger? You have a bunger with the hat. Bunger, bunger, hat bunger. <laughs> How's it going? It's got a flat hat cap on. Yeah, it's adorable. We have to collect them all, dude. Women also have butts, but I'm not a woman. All all women have butts, but not all butts are female. It's it's like a Venn diagram. You can put the butt circle. No, you can put the female circle inside the butt, but you can't put the butt circle inside the female. You can put the male circle inside the butt. You can put the female circle inside the butt. But you cannot put the butt circle inside of either the male or the female circles. More likely for them to get paper points. Yes. All right, let's go. Ah, so soon. We're not quite ready yet. We could use another few days of assessment. What are you talking about, Snorp Dog? We got the raft ready in record time. Let's go get everybody. <sighs> of course, Chandler. All right, cake boy. All righty. I'm here and ready to explore. Ooh, nice work on that raft there, Chandlo. Thanks, Brofany. Indeed. Uh, wouldn't it be sis If it is not more than a finely crafted tomb for the foolish wanderers. Of course, Snorpington can get volunteers. <laughs> uh -huh. But it seems a vagrant has wandered into our expedition. Snacksburg is that way, Shelda. Dang. <gasps> Be still, your wicked tongue. <laughs> One must show respect to one's elders. I will respect you as soon as you do something respectable. Ooh. Oh, you think so highly of yourself that you alone are they who can know the unknowable? No, you bring ruin to all that you touch. Ruin to Egabel. Ruin to Elizabeth. Ruin to your own flesh. And blood. I'm starting to think this might not have been the best idea. You know, six folks is a lot for one raft. Maybe one of us ought to stay back home. 
Which one? Uh... We're all going. Me and Snorpy can hold it together. Actually, Chando, uh, well, I was thinking you and I should stay here and supervise. What? Bro, why'd I build all this stuff if we're not going? Don't you want to know what's on the new island? Well, uh, of course I do, but look at that thing. That island is a death trap. Come on, Snorp Dog. It's probably fine. Look, I gotta go out there. They need me. Yes, somebody needs to caddy the septuagenarian. What? Shut it. You can go if you must, Chandlo. But I'm staying here. But mm. bro, we do everything together. What if something happens to you while I'm gone? Me? Well, I'll be on this lovely beach. What if something happens to you? Yes, yes, you can both be struck by a meteor at any moment. Honestly, they do this every time Chen Lo goes to check the mail. <laughs> can we stop wasting time and get on with this expedition before I'm as old as Shelda? <clears throat> you two are like mirrors, reflecting endlessly. One must look away from the infinite abyss and gaze down only at oneself. What? Oh. Far be it for me to give anyone life advice, but there's nothing wrong with a little time apart. It's healthy, even. All right. If you all say so. No. Don't worry. I'll be in radio contact the entire time. I disagree. I was hoping they'd both come. At least three of you. Right. Trackers. Okay. Then let's get this party started. What was that about trackers? Bro, I'll let you do the honors. Just jump on the raft when you're ready. Okay. <laughs> you interrupted Sprinklebutt watching his Chad. Well, they interrupted me watching mine. No, I'm not Nyumzies. The best subscription you get is Dragon's Twitch to YouTube. Aw, oh, thanks, GTA. I appreciate it. Yes, I do like the DLC. It's fun. But we're just about to go to the new island, which I'm really, really excited about. I'm just peeking to see if anybody's got a hat. I don't see any bug snacks with hats. All right, time to go then. We're setting sail, Wigglies! Tracking the butt. Do not track the butt. The butt deserves its freedom. All right, Snorp Dog. We made it to the other island. We found some kind of reef cove thing to land on. Chandler, listen to me. It's very important. You need to understand that remote detonator. Snorpy! Oh, Grump, the radio's broken. No, no. Well, that didn't take long. Just out of range. Or there could be some interference going on. Oh, how unfortunate. I suppose we will have to proceed without Snorpington's so called supervision. But maybe we should go back and tell him? It'll only take an hour. An hour? The threshold is crossed. It cannot be uncrossed. <laughs> <laughs> and if you think I'm spending another minute on that plank of wood today, <laughs> you are dead wrong. Yeah, you're always right, Shelda. Snorpy knows we got this. He'd want us to keep exploring. Huh. Looks like there's a way across up there. Let's check it out, bro. <laughs> I'm actually looking forward to the new soundtracks. I really want to hear the... Because I always love the music in this game. So I'm going to be listening and vibing a bit. I wonder if you have any new dialogue? Hmm. These coral structures are the only animal species I've witnessed anywhere near the Snacktooth biosphere. Intriguing. Hmm. Can I study them? No. Only you. Despite one's years, there ever remains a sense of humbling beauty where sand meets sea, and not a toxin in sight. For those who aren't familiar with the core game, she calls bug snacks toxins. Every time she, she talks about a toxin, she's talking about the bug snacks. Who steps onto this island and I'm already seeing evidence of ancient Grumpus technology? Oh, this trip is definitely going to be worth it. <laughs> An ice cream burg? No. Everyone commented made the original, but it's bug snacks, not butt snacks. What was the comment? <laughs> right behind you, bro. Yeah, I was really hoping they'd both be here, man. that thing up? I bet Snorpy's trip shot could do it. Ah, yeah, I remember how that works. No! Last one across is a rotten eggler! No, 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 no! You're the rotten eggler. Get re wait, what? Where are we going? Well, what 
Jung, look at that. Some kind of ancient maze carving. With moving parts in everything. I think we need Sprout. Well, whoever built it put it directly in our way. Chen Lu, you excel in brute force. Destroy this. <laughs> you got it, floof dog! Call me floof dog again and see what happens. <laughs> now hold on, hold on there. Let's not go smashing the priceless antiques oh. just yet. Looks like you could fit your buggy ball down there in the entrance. <laughs> I bet if we solve this maze, <laughs> something real interesting is gonna happen. Okay. Strange! With a tier one five movies, I'm not yumsies. Oh, the exclamation mark hyphen chat for Strange's tier one five month resub. You maintain access to all the Gar emotes and enjoy those emotes and enjoy the sub badge next to your name. Strange, I hope you're doing well, my precious Wiggly friend. It's good to see you. Thank you so much for your continued support. So, Draggy calls everyone dude. Where are you going with this? Wait, no, I, I call the, I call the chicks chicks and I call the dudes dudes, but where are you going with this? Go, 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 make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. Yeah. Goodness, that mechanism still wow. works after all this time. Not to mention the water damage. If that's Sprout, are just you okay? <laughs> door, who knows what historical goodies we'll find inside there. I kind of hate that I okay calm down buddy holy crap I can't I hate that I can't turn the camera while people are talking to me so I'm, I'm rooted in whatever camera angle like I'm s <gasps> whoa look at that no not you that I can't see it from here it's too far whoa whoa it's a jungle out there oh goodness to think that this whole valley was underwater not that long ago. I can even see evidence of civilization from who knows when. Oh, check out that impressive looking temple up there. One is more concerned with the ominous crater that lies beneath. If my eyes do not deceive me, I believe I've spotted new varieties of bug snacks as well. New bug snacks? Sick! Think they could be dangerous? There's an easy way to find out. <laughs> well, uh, before we get too ahead of ourselves, we might want to set up a base camp. A wonderful idea. One could use time to <laughs> ah, recenter. Five minutes in, and you already need a nap. Leave the labor to the productive members of society, then. Jeez. Oh, please don't start this again. Bros! Come check this out! What? You seeing what I'm seeing? <gasps> bunger! It's bunger time! Yeah, but that's a big bunger. Excellent. Why don't you go and fetch it for us, Chen Lo? <laughs> Way ahead of you! Don't do it! Oh. Don't do it! No! Oh dear. You better go follow and help him out. We'll stay up here and start setting up camp. That's a gigantic bunger. Holy big bunger. It's a bunger, but big. Bunger Royale? <laughs> There's always a bigger bunger. <laughs> and what do you mean, so Dre? You say like, I'm not saying I like dudes. I just, it's a commonly used phrase. That's all. Hey, go Bella. How's it going? Not num num delicious. Uh, let's get down carefully. Wait, is it just me? Or is that no, 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 way bigger than the bro? <gasps> Chandler. My muscles and my bones. What is this? Where am I? I hit some kind of statue room. Looks like she's holding a thing. I don't know what that is. A temporarily shrink spike, gigantic bug. Maybe that'll do something. Oh, it's on a timer. Yay! Oh, wait, wait, hurry, 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 hurry. Stopped being big! I bet it's small enough to catch now! No, 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 no! Yes! Yay! I got the Bunger Royale. Bunger! You okay? You don't look so hot, but... Alright, bro. You got Bunger? I got hunger! <laughs> now Bunger me, bro! No, but I made you melon! Oh, I gotta feed him the Bunger Royale. Alright, fine. Numb it. Uh, body. 
so good. <laughs> That's a whole meal in one bite. We got to tell the others about this. Plus, I should probably help unpack. I liked you more as Melon. I'm going to change it back. Did you all see that? Giant bug snacks. Even <laughs> the bungers out here are as big as Mama Melon. Gosh, we might be witnessing a prehistoric species somehow preserved at the bottom of the ocean. Aha, uh -huh. that would align with my theory on the correlation between age and size. The lost sister of Snacktooth lies unburied. Yet you marvel at the engorgement of the toxins that dance on her grave. The lost what now? What are you talking about? Tell me, Chenlo. How did you come to capture this specimen? We found a jar of some kind of small dust. It came out of this old lady statue thing. A statue, eh? What did it look like? Like a big friendly grumpus lady with flowers all around her. Uh, no. That sounds like it could be a shrine to Mother Nature. Whoa. Shelda, that's your thing. No, 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 no. Ah, but why would Mother Nature, no to despise her of bug snacks, be dispensing bug snack catching equipment? Hmm? Shelda, your god is a hypocrite. Silence, you wretch. <laughs> the mother guides, the mother protects. If you so doubt, then one will wield the light of truth against your blasphemy. Is she leaving? Okay, then. Uh, I guess Shelda's gonna go check out those shrines. I mean, she's right there. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, I gotta go take a look at all the ruins around here. There's so much ancient history to uncover. I'm giddy just thinking about it. I am fascinated by this shrink spice and its effects on snack matter. If I can determine exactly what it's made of, I'm certain we will have much use for it. All right, bros. I know I'm not a scientist, but I got a hypothesis. Oh. If this island can make Big Bunger, can it make Big Chandler? <laughs> That's not what a hypothesis is. Honestly, what does my brother see in you? Hey, they're in oh, love. Hush, I'm sure it's worth a try. Well then, let's get to it. <laughs> I approve you. No, no, I did not admit yumsies. Never yumsies. It's sure thing split. Best of luck with the workout. I'll see you later. So I must be shrunk down and captured. That is terrifying. As my dragon self, I would hate that. Oh, thank you for the lurk, Cinder. Not gain yumsies! No! Man, everybody wants to talk to me. All right. Wait, 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 Chandlo. Let's eat first. What would you look like? Oh, no. <laughs> He's Bunger Royalified now. Oh, no. <laughs> this is what he would look like if, if he was full Bunger Royale. I don't know, man. I think he looked better with the with the melon. I don't like the burger nose. Everything else actually looks fine. The tater tot arms and legs, but the the burger nose, it, I don't like it very much. I think they could have just made that another tot. Maybe I'm partial to the color green, but I think he looked better as a melon. Yeah, that's but but this is DLC though. But he looks better like this. I think this looks better. No! No, but it's not game! I don't have sprinkle, but don't you dare! Bad! I'm already in love with the atmosphere of this new location. I like it too. I like it too. All right, well, let's do stuff. What do you want to do? Bro, I gotta see if eating these big bug snacks <laughs> will make me big Chandlo. <laughs> I saw this huge snack lifting stuff near the river. Big lifting? You know I gotta get me some of that. <laughs> Good huge. Catch one club story. I mean, there's no reason why we couldn't just pick up all the quests right now. All right, what's up? One must see what lies within those supposed shrines to Mother Nature. Not shrines destroyed and forgotten, but one untouched by the ravages of time. One can see it up along the river's path. That is the place we must meet. However, the shrine is beyond one's reach. Yet again, you must remove an obstacle that shrouds the path. Okay. What about you? What do you want? Oh, thank goodness you're here. 
I'd say it's high time we get to exploring. I see another maze blocking the way deeper into the jungle. I bet if we solve it, we'll find something real exciting. I'll go ahead and make my way over to the maze. Meet me there when you're ready for some puzzling. <laughs> okay, and you? This shrinking spice intrigues me. What substance could produce such a pronounced effect on bug snacks? From what I observed, it was manufactured by ancient grumpuses, so surely it'll be simple to recreate. They seem pretty advanced, actually. Well, I don't know. Maybe Shelda would know about it? No, she wouldn't. Oh, please. Bring an ancient grumpus to the present and they'd be utterly lost. Anything they can do, I can do fundamentally better. Frivolities aside, I require a sample of shrink spice for study. Bring a specimen here and place it into my trough. Well, that should be easy. I mean, we have some very close by, right? We could probably complete that first. Bunger? Make him look like the DLC Draggy? I suppose I should. Since I've eaten one single bug snack? Probably. This game makes you hungry. Some of the stuff looks better than others. Is she holding an arm bone? Yes. She's a archaeologist and she specializes in, like... The people, I guess. Like, what would they call that? What's, what's the branch of, like, archaeology that's focused on, like, people? Go, 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 go. Got it. That was easy. <laughs> hmm. It seems this substance becomes quite volatile when removed from its origin. A flaw in its design, perhaps. How troublesome. I may need to employ a more direct method of study. By which I mean, bring another sample here and throw it at me before it combusts. Oh, really? Okay. Isn't that dangerous? Oh, I do want to throw things at you. Yes, I'm told physical violence can be quite cathartic. <laughs> <laughs> Since the spice causes no apparent harm to bug snacks, I am reasonably certain that I will be fine. <laughs> well, let's go do that then. Here we go. Paleontology? Okay. Anthropology, paleontology. This is bug snacks. Yeah. Um. What was I going to say? I was going to say something. I forgot what it was. No, get up. But yeah, she, this particular character, for those who aren't familiar with the core game, she is, like, obsessed with, like, pursuing science, and she will do anything to achieve it. Like, she wanted me to drill in... Ah, the goggles! They do nothing! Ah. <coughs> <coughs> mm, if you couldn't tell, <coughs> that was rather unpleasant. <laughs> I couldn't tell. Can you elaborate? <clears throat> However, having experienced that, I have learned two very important facts. One, the substance does not work on grumpuses. Two, I should not do that again. I am no closer to obtaining a usable sample of shrink spice. However, I believe we may learn something from the local bug snacks. Use the shrink spice to capture one cheddar and one millimochi. Millimochi. Then transform me with those specimens. All right, fine. But anyways, as I was saying, she's like obsessed with science to the point where she doesn't mind dangerous self-experimentation. So she will like... There was a part of the game where she wanted to test if, like, she could uh, use bug snacks to, like, regenerate lost limbs. So she was, I think she strapped herself to a machine and she was going to saw off her limbs and try to use bug snacks to, like, grow them back. <laughs> it was, like, really terrifying. I think her brother, like, intervened and told her to stop. Like, she was out of her mind. Hmm. Let's try this out. Paleontology is plants, if you remember. Wait, wait, wait. What have I done? Whoa, that was a close call. What the heck is this? Cheddar begins rolling the bullshit. Years of archaeology. That was my first run-in with a giant rolling ball. We need that for 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 Floofty's quest. Get the ball. Ah, it's too fast. I think I've got to intercept it. Come on, come on. No, no, no. I can outrun it. I can outrun it just barely. If I take a smarter path. Re! We have a problem. I need to get in front of it. No, 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 no. Re, dude! Alright, intercept it. We're gonna go the opposite direction. 
Study of ancient plants is paleontology. Paleontology is plants and animals. Swifty's a girl. I can't tell. Uh, she is non-binary. Or, uh, I shouldn't say she. They, they are non-binary. I believe they are non-binary. All right. Yes! No! I need to catch a bug snack, you bad! The arguing yeah. Distracting, you know. Trouble with Flufty? Well, you know Flufty. They're smart as a whip and twice as painful. <laughs> I feel like they expect more out of me than I can give, though. Gosh, I don't know. I feel like I ought to be taking more of a leadership role out here. But I do all my best work when I'm alone. <clears throat> but why talk about all that unpleasantness when we could be neck deep in some dusky corpses? <laughs> the maze is right there. Welp. Uh, okay. We have to intercept that thing again. It probably grew back to normal size. Or maybe it didn't? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> heck, my game design. Hey! How the heck did you sneak around me? Okay, okay, that's fine. I think we can still intercept it. I think we have enough time. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Re. Get him out, get him out, get him out, get him out. Get out. What the heck? What the heck? That's mine! Re. Oh my gosh. Get the ball. Oh my gosh, dude. Okay, fine. We'll play this a bit more strategically. Patience. 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 What the heck? Where is it? Big to go in there, even as a small. Mm. Okay, okay. New plan. This music's kind of nice, by the way. It's too fast, dude. Uh. Wait, where are you going? Deviating from the path. Come on. You gotta come back here. Go ahead. Turn big again, I dare you. Okay, I mean, if he's just gonna chill there, I almost feel like this is a bug. Maybe we can just hit him directly. What? He went poof! What the crap was that?! What the heck? Okay, 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 another one's coming, another one's coming. This time we get him. Go, 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 go. Go! Go! No! Go that way! Ah! Squish this thing! Step on it! Smack it! Oh my. Okay. Is that good? Hopefully. We have more time. Why don't we put it on an even lower elevation? Uh huh. Lower. Okay, there's no way it rolls underneath that. <sighs> it's not a bug, it's a bug snack! 
Keep the bodies cool. <laughs> Bride of all smoochy, but all right, all right. Relax, guy. You can get it. Yeah, it's taking way too long to catch this one, dude. All right, now we wait patiently. <sighs> Tikada Masala. Patrols the area around the sense, keeping a lookout for eggler shells. This flying fiend's fire is so hot that it will ignite the very air within your lungs. Well, that or I have heartburn. You probably have heartburn. Where's the big ball? There it is. Okay, okay. This time it's gonna work. There's no way this is going to fail. Finally! Oh. Okay. Now, I need to catch you. Millie Mochi. It travels in a line with its friends, leaping out and freezing anything that crosses its path. It seems to change color and flavor based on its emotion. I'm curious what happiness tastes like. Happiness is not yumsies. It's a ball of cheese. It's a very squirmy ball of cheese. <gasps> it loves chocolate. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> that is so adorable. Did they all just bump each other apart? <laughs> we need to burn it somehow. What is it like? It likes chocolate. What do you like? <laughs> no back yumsies! Hey mate, how's it going? Come back here. What? We need that guy. There you are. Why does it hate Agabelle? Oh, because she's Agabelle, I see. Keep it coming. Well, we do want to catch it, but but I need your help first. <laughs> Get it. Did you eat it? You weren't supposed to eat it! It's not the Yumsies! You're supposed to neutralize it! Oh my god! Okay, okay. New plan, new plan. <laughs> Come here. Usually water works. Come here. Come here, come here. It numbed the mochi. No double bag yumsies! If we lure it to the water, I think it'll it'll warm them up. The freak I've never seen a bug snack eat another bug snack. What the heck happened? Oh no. No no. Oh no! <laughs> he froze. No, come back! Milly, Milly, Mochi, Milly, Milly, Mochi. Ah! Come here. They're the cutest bug snack I've seen in the DLC so far. Open your eyes! I don't know. Maybe we need to use environmental fire. Okay, then fine. We need to get the fire to spread. Where can we get fire? Whoa, is that? Club Cerrone, strong enough to lift other bugs as well as its beloved trampoline. Loves hot sauce. And it loves... Cheese. I bet I could lift that trampoline. <laughs> Feeling a little threatened, bud? Alright, let's try something. Ah, there's fire. Okay. I need a shrinker thingy. All right, let's use this. We shrink it, and then we catch it. I might be able to use it to my advantage, though. I could launch myself up there using it, couldn't I? It'll respawn, it's fine. Let's catch it first. 
Okay, now. Please tell me that's going to work. Yes! <laughs> Hooray for wide hitboxes. <laughs> Yeah, I think we needed his help to bounce up there, but it's okay. We can come back and respawn him and he'll help us. But we could have jumped from here to that trampoline. And that's our fire source too, so we could ignite everything using that. What's over here? Huh. This looks important, but I don't think we can do anything about it yet. Let's talk to Shandlow. He wanted this bug snack. How are we going to get that spider up there? I don't know how we're going to do that. He's really high up. We'll figure it out. Chandlo! Alright, he wants this one in particular, so... You want to numb the Clubsteroni. Where is it? Clubs? Well, now you're just yellow. <laughs> oh, yeah! I can feel the lifting energy inside me. But I didn't get bigger at all. Guess I didn't get huge eating that big bunger either. You know what, bro? I'm just gonna admit to myself that it's not gonna work and move on. Guess that means my investigation's over already. What do I do now? I kind of don't believe you. Challenge all the bug snacks to fights. Bro, if I can't handle big bunger, I don't stand a chance against the rest. Goals for the future, maybe. <laughs> Help the others investigate. I'm already helping where I can, bro. But I'm not a scientist. Floofty said if I touch their lab again, they give me an excoriating worthy of my fatuity. What does that even mean? <laughs> excoriating worthy of my fatuity. No, I'm not going to numb the bug snacks. Relax, huh? I guess it's been a while since I just chilled. I've been so busy. Fixing up Snacksburg, training, life coaching, and, you know, I've always got to take care of Snorpy. What the grump? Let's hang. We ought to shoot some hoops. <laughs> Let's shoot hoops. All right. <laughs> hoops, 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 hoops. <laughs> All right, it's hoops time. Let's go. You know the rules, dog. We're going to take turns shooting hoops. First one to make five baskets wins. All right. Go ahead and shoot your first shot. Oh man. Uh. Well, I mean, if it's gonna auto aim or not auto aim. You got one point. My turn. Your turn. Go for it. How do you dribble with the melon hands? Grump, I miss. <laughs> pleb, 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 pleb. Bro, pauses. Bro, pauses. Easy. My turn. <laughs> nice. nice. Okay. All right. Fine. 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 Fair. My turn. Yay! My turn. <laughs> Two points. Okay, 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 okay. Not bad, not bad, sir. But I think this match is already just decided. <laughs> My turn. Go for it. <laughs> I got three Dang points. it! You're scaring me. Stop getting close. <laughs> Take your time. Don't mess it up. Okay, that should be fine. Yes! Bravo, boys! You won, dog! I didn't know you were such a ball. Such a baller. You gotta have a rematch sometime. No. <laughs> I permanently win. No rematch. <laughs> Thanks for playing with me, bro. Now that we're done hanging, I gotta get back to Snacksburg. I gotta go check on Snorpy. Wait, you're leaving? Uh, yeah, these are all kind of true. Or er, we kind of need that raft. I'll just make another raft. Or I'll swim back if I have to. The ocean's not that tough. <laughs> Bro, I'm gonna be real with you. This is the longest I've been away from Snorpy in years. And he's not okay without me. Aww. How about this? I'm gonna need some big energy for the trip back. You get me two of the biggest, strongest bug snacks on this island. And I'll stick around till I'm fueled up. Yellow bite and a celly sticks. Okay, all right. No, I don't know my way around handling balls. Just the basketballs. No, I did not get dominated. I'm doing very well, thank you very much.
He looks like he belongs in my mac and cheese. I don't like it. I get this is the DLC, but I still feel like the Mama Melon one looks better. It is silly, though. <laughs> We're gonna keep you as Melon Boy. You look best like that. Okay. So, still need to catch a Mama Mochi. I'll figure it out. All right. Although I do also, wait, is this rain gonna be a problem? I'm trying to start fires and I think this rain could be an issue. Launch me! Yay! Hopefully it's just, you know, it's hopefully it's just appearance and it doesn't actually do anything. Ah, these stay permanently lit. Ooh, can you reach over there? You can. Well, that happened. I don't know how to get there, though. We'd have to lure the trampoline bro to the other side. And there's probably a way to do that. Anything else I can do? That might be a shrine that's been untouched. That might be what Shelda wants for her quest. Bro, I have a feeling that, like, Chandler is gay. <laughs> you don't say! What tipped you off? Was the fact that he, he wanted to check all of them <laughs> Snorpy Sprinkle Butt's special spots when rubbing sunscreen all over him? Or the fact that he just can't- re re I accidentally did that perfectly. <laughs> You're supposed to time that, and I just kind of ran in willy-nilly, and, and I got away with it. Your detective powers astound me, sir. Uh, this is useless. Go to the other side. Oh, wait, no, no, no. It got us to the higher ledge. Get up! What the heck do I do here? There's nothing I can do here. Re, I fell. Nice! The bug snacks was the key. The answer is always the bug snack. Make it, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. Re! Now that I'm actually like trying, I'm missing it. <laughs> Come on, bro. Help me out here. Egg! Egg, 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 and egg. Egg, 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 and egg. Egg, 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 and egg. There's an egg. Here's an egg. Egg, egg, egg. I burned the egg. Cook egg. No egg shake Egg, 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 and egg. Egg, egg. Oh, love you too, Leafy. Um, this isn't doing anything. Maybe I shouldn't set it on fire. Well, it doesn't want to get moved anymore. I may have derped. <laughs> I mean, I don't know what I need an egg for. Egg, 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 and egg. Egg, egg, egg. Oh. You again. Hmm. Millie Mochi, it's another one. Millie, Millie Mochi, Millie, Millie Mochi, Millie Mochi. You burnt the egg with your dragon breath, but I'm an ice dragon. You burned the babu again. I guess it was like an all night or farther one. I didn't, that's not my egg. I just, I didn't, I've never even been in there except just now. That's not my egg. I don't like eggs. Oh, 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 I know what I'm supposed to do. I know what I'm supposed to do. I know what I'm supposed to do. Okay, okay, okay. I know it, I know, I know, I know. Come on, trampoline bro. We gotta get across. Yes. Perfect. We gotta put this on this. Uh-huh. Ha! Ha! It's okay, that's all I needed. We're just trying to unlock the area. That should reach. Bingo! Alright. I think we're doing pretty good. What proof do you have? Did another Dirk sign it? No, but I didn't sign it! I'm innocent until proven guilty. You cannot prove that Snoot laid the egg. I'm not female. Sorry, I forgot your ice dragon. Don't worry about it. It's fine. 
Maybe I can lure this Millie Mochi to the fire. Millie Mochi. <laughs> These are so adorable. Millie Mochi. You know, chocolate. You know you want it. You know you want it. Come have chocolate. 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 Get over here and have the chocolate, you piece of crap! He refuses to go this far. Ah. Maybe if I use this, it'll change his mind. It doesn't matter. Dang it. Can I reach him with this? Yes! Yes! Finally! Did you notice this color change when I stunned him? Because remember, uh... Floofty was saying that their their color changes based off their emotion. The male seahorse is carrying this. Well, I'm not a seahorse, I'm a dragon! I'm firing your eyes, that's proof. No, it's not! <laughs> Spongebob reference, you're right. Okay, so I think we can progress Floofty's quest. Am I supposed to put an egg in here? Yes, that's exactly what I'm supposed to do. Oh. <laughs> Deviled Eggler. Egglers with wings and aggressive tendencies. <laughs> Once hatched, they're a bit runny. You'll have to poach them before they scramble. <laughs> that's amazing. How the heck am I gonna cool it off? Can I lure it down with something? It loves hot sauce. Okay, easy. Well, I don't have to do anything because you guys are still sauced with hotness. Wait, 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 I wasn't- I forgot I need to make you small! No! Grapple this! Get him! Yes! Got it! Bro boys. Millie Millie Mochi. So reptiles can change their sex. Well, I am not one of them. I am pure male 100%. Nothing female about me, not through appearance or behavior. Do I do the po posies? I got it. I got it. All right, we're gonna go feed Floofty now. Hey, oh, I've got the snack snack. You want uh, turn Floofty's hand into Chedorb? Chedorb. <clears throat> Intriguing. Turn Floofty's leg into Millie Mochi. Millie Mochi. Yum yum yum. Unbelievable. <laughs> Wait, what? That wasn't the leg! Wait, wait, it's fine, it's fine. I can do this. Holy crap, I fed you a lot of things. <laughs> That's a foot, not a leg. Turn Floofty's- oh, right. I forgot. Turn Floofty's hand into Chedorb. Ah, decently <laughs> competent work. Unfortunately... Any remnants of the spice seem to have been digested, but this too yields interesting results. In their shrunken state, the bug snacks here are not fundamentally different from those on Snack Tooth proper. Hmm. Why do they grow so big? My butt and thighs are not feminine. They're very masculine, muscular shaped, and they do not do any feminine things. No, I don't have any feminine orientations. Don't you smug me, mister. I'm a strong, independent, adult male, quadrupedal dragon. A very respectable creature. I am still forming my hypotheses, but I presume the process is endemic to this island, and the spice was created to inhibit it. Are there any side effects? None beyond the usual. <laughs> After all, Chandler ate a Bunga Royale as soon as we arrived. And he seems alive and well. Hmm. You said this would be simple. It will be simple. I am merely exhausting every avenue of study. It's called being thorough. Look it up. Now, I've observed chocolates capable of maintaining a small size. This may present a more stable vessel for the spice. Regrettably, I must not eat it, delicious though it may be. <laughs> so bring one to my science trough, please. <laughs> Regrettably, I must not eat it. Delicious as it may be. <laughs> I love how she has to professionally, with fancy science words, basically say, like, oh, it's delicious, but I shouldn't eat it because I need to study it. 
Uh, what was the uh, Millie Mochi, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, let's let's see what the Ched a full Ched Orb body would look like. Oh, jeez, I don't like that at all. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Go back to Millie Mochi, and I think you're gonna keep that look. I think it suits you. I usually like to pick a bug snack that they ask for and turn their entire body into that. You are Millie Mochi now. You're still there. I don't depend on meal milk, you bad! That's not true! I don't run on meal milk! I can operate just fine without any meal milk inside of it! You bad! No! You take it back, that is not true! No, it's not dummy thick rear either! The Millie Mochi hair, I like it too. The little. <laughs> the little like mochi chunks with the sticks. Like. <laughs> it's adorable. It's like Elvis Presley hair. What? I know I'm not super, like, educated when it comes to pop culture, but I don't think Elvis Presley had, like, a bald head and just sticks and then, like, with wads of hair just attached to, like, those sticks. Pretty sure he had, like, a smooth, flat hairstyle. You know the other one? I guess I don't know the other one. Your favorite holiday is Christmas? That's correct. Is this a bug snacks update? Yes. Mi no. No male milk. No. I think we need to go up to that shrine. That's not Millie Mochi. Oh, the Ched Orb one, you mean? You like the Ched Orb hair. I already forgot what it looked like. Wait, how do we get to the front of that? Oh, I know how. What do you like? Hot sauce and cheese. Good sir, would you be so kind as to go this way? Thank you. Is this not what I needed for my quest? Shelda wanted me to go to a location that was like undisturbed. Shelda wants to see the shrine of Mother Nature for herself, but the way there is blocked by a wall of rocks. I should investigate there thoroughly to find a way to remove it. Destroy the obstacle in the river. In the river? I'll find it. Do you chug eggnog? I I don't think I've actually ever had eggnog in my life. Bug snacks is great. Hot garo suck and cheese. No! I don't get guys from sucky sucky. No, that's not true. Muzzle because you do no no. There's no no. I don't wear a muzzle. My mozzie is perfectly fine as it is without any muzzle on it. Obstacle in the river. No, not cheesy. Why don't we go ahead and solve this real quick since we can? Oh, go. I need your help. Chocolates. Girls when exposed to the open air. Oh, it threw me out. He likes to play keep away with his fellow chocolates. Like all bullies, they become cowardly when shrunk. Hmm. It's a big snack that's actually small. Eggnog is the only alcohol that I can stomach. Wait, it's alcoholic? I didn't actually know that. Ever just chug sparkling water? Not really. No, it will not! I don't want a muzzle! You get the non-alcoholic eggnog. I don't get it. I thought one of these ants before helped me get higher. I don't know why that one, like, chucked me out. Got it. Pilobite. It's protective cover to flex string spice. The snack grappler would help to remove it. <laughs> Look at its tiny little pie tin legs. <laughs> <gasps> it's pecan pie. Oh, I love pecan pie. Dude, that's so cute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you know the devs were having fun developing this guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's not interactable until it's done sprinting. <laughs> Just exactly how I'd imagine a living python to talk. <laughs> Apparently, python beats giant cheese boulder. <laughs> 
kill me. <laughs> Catch the pie. Yeah, yeah, I need him. <gasps> Whoa. Sally stick, so big that it unknowingly carries smaller bugs next on its back. I like it better with grape skewers, but you do you. Oh, there's chocolates on it, yeah. No, 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 grab this. <laughs> We're gonna get a shrink shrink. <sighs> That's not launching. Oh. Boy, 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 boy. <laughs> Dang it, he's probably gonna get his tin back. We gotta find a shrink thing quick. I mean, if it's like, you know, whipped cream, that's fine. I like whipped cream, kind of, but it's not very healthy. But I don't like the kind of cream pie you're referring to with the wink, mister. No. The cr First off, it goes in the mozzie. Second off, it's whipped cream, okay? It's, it's a food cream that people normally eat normally. Where's it going? I don't know. Oh, it's just circling this area, I think. With the cream, no, 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 no. Come here. What? Hacking freaking celery stick grasshopper thing! Yes, <laughs> mine. <laughs> Halibut. Cheesy glob and cheese noodle bits. Box knife here's left the immediate area, but it's still nearby. I'm trying to scan. Oh, can I not scan what's on its back? Okay. Alright, well, I mean, this doesn't seem too hard. All I have to do is bring some... I'm referring to completely normal pie that people enjoy. Well, then this is acceptable. As long as it's a normal pie, a platonic pie, and not a smug cream pie, then it is acceptable. Past the mozzie, then on the thighsies. No, 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 no. This kind of cream pie goes straight into the mozzie, okay? And it is... It is a sweet, sugary cream. It's a food item. Intended for consumption. Oh, I don't think it liked that. Charge me. <laughs> it looked so angry. Chocolate. Grows when exposed to the open air. Likes to play keep away with his fellow chocolates. <laughs> it's so cute. That gave me an idea for a riddle. Oh, riddles again? Give me one. Now I want pie. I would like some too. Dude, the pie tin is, is the cutest one. <laughs> Millie Mochi is, is up there. I really like Millie Mochi, but that pie tin is so adorable. <laughs> the way it like pitter pattered around with its tiny little tin feetsies. I loved it. No, the thighsies don't get thick. I numb healthfully, so the thighsies stay at a normal healthy weight. Never had coconut cream pies, Gara. No, actually, I have not. Hmm. I was trying to avoid that. Where? Where's the? What the heck? Where did it go? Oh, I see it. It's just small. All right, be patient. Be patient. Go on. Keep walking. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yes. <laughs> Mine. Mm. And Gravelies will bring some snacks, yes, otherwise you'll feel hungry. What food is more fun making than eating? Um, eggplant salad. So you gotta head to, uh, oh no, I'm so sorry to hear that, Satoshi. Hope everything's okay. Please message me later, let me know how it's going on. Stay safe, please. No, I don't go in the pie, I'm not yumsies! We need fire. Mochi. <laughs> no. <laughs> um, by the snoot. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, maybe this goes backwards. I mean, if I was smart. Hang on a sec. What's your patrol route? 
What do you like? You like hot sauce, right? Maybe I can lure you. What I I know you know the answer. Food that's more fun to make than it is to eat. Ah. Uh, You didn't even ignite it. I don't know, dude. Um, any like salad. He can't ignite it. That's not how it works. Okay. Let's go back and do some feeding. Carl Pie. No, I'm not. I don't want to pie. I'm not going to have ants on a log. There you go. Brownies. Brownies are delicious, though. You wanted... Wait, what did you want again? You're pretty sure you wanted the chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> At last, mm -hmm. a viable sample. Now I can extract the powder and finally put this mystery to rest. This requires my utmost concentration, and you ask far too many questions. You may return when I found my answer. <laughs> okay. Did I accomplish... I destroyed the obstacle. The past once more revealed, and yet... No less treacherous. One's heart is filled with dread for the truths yet unknown within the River Shrine. Nevertheless, we must push forward. <laughs> okay. You wanted something, right? No, I don't want a basket. Wait, what, what did you want again? You wanted me to feed you something. What exactly did you want? Pilobite and celly sticks. Okay. Pilobite. <laughs> oh dang, it turned his whole body into the tin can. Or the, the tin container. Celery sticks. Why would you want to get stronger with celery? Oh, that color actually suits you. <laughs> I think I ate too much. So good though. No regrets. Oh, hey, while you were out there, I've been thinking. Before I go, I need some major guidance. Normally, there's stuff I can't talk about because Snorpy's always listening in. So, if not now, when? All right, what is it? All right, Shelda's waiting. All right, it's guidance time. Hey, Sheldog, can I get some of your wisdom? Always, my child. I'm worried about Snorpy. Once more shall you be reminded. Snorpy is safer than we, Chandlo. Ease your burden. That's... that's not what I mean. I'm worried about the way he's been. All the paranoid stuff, the anxiety. I thought bringing Snorpy out here, out into nature, it might mellow him out. Flush all the bad vibes out of his system. But it's only gotten worse. I've known Snorpy all my life. But it feels like he's getting further away from me, and, and I just don't know what to do. Aww. Uh, one must in the path of the mother. No, uh, hold on. One does not want one's words to be misinterpreted when one says that boy needs therapy. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, for sure. And I'm trying to do that. I make sure he's safe. I listen to his problems. I try to help him feel valid. All that stuff. Chandlo, you are strong and wise and wonderful. And you can do everything to support him. But you cannot fix him. Understand? Snorpy is lost in a maze of his own making. And it will take a professional to help him escape. That's a lot to take in. I need to think about it. Thanks for your wisdom, Shelda. You know, thank me when you actually take my advice. <laughs> hey, bro. <laughs> while I'm still out here, I want to talk to Triffany and Floofty, too. There's still more I gotta know, you know? The problem is, Snorpy is actually right. You find out the Grumpinati is real. His paranoia is actually like, tr like everything he suspects is true. <laughs> hey, beat me, Sal. How's it going? Celestic was doing the stick bug? It was. Oh, yeah, you're right. It was. The pot is only maybe just a little bit yumsy sometimes, Jobog. Ask Trip. Wait, they're all gone. Wait, wait, no, no, you're here. 
How's the analysis going? Blast it all! I do not need your distractions. I've obtained dried particles of plant slurry, but I have no way to analyze them. It's like living in the Stone Age out here. Perhaps if I had a particle separator, an electron microscope, and a degree in botany... Mm, bah! Plants are not my area of expertise. We do know an herbalist. You cannot be serious! I would sooner eat my bow tie than listen to a word of Shelda's advice. Admit it, you need her help. All right, eat your bow tie right now. That was clearly a statement of hyperbole. <laughs> I very much like this bow tie, and I will not eat it even if doing so wins an argument. <laughs> what if Shelda can help? <laughs> if Shelda knows the secret of the shrink spice, I will eat my bow tie. Okay. Very well. <laughs> Since you clearly won't stop pestering me about this, let us go see Shelda. <laughs> One Spoil senses the reek of a foul prison. <laughs> Cease your hostility, Shelda. I am here on business. I've been informed that you may possess a rudimentary understanding of phytochemical reactions, which I am in need of. <gasps> Strike the stars from the sky! The Wicked One has come to me for guidance. But surely one's ancient ways are far too primitive compared to the miracles of modern science. I do not appreciate your sarcasm. <laughs> if you do not wish to help me, then simply say so and be gone with you. One would never. It is one's path to offer guidance to all who seek it, no matter how undeserving they may be. <laughs> Very well. <laughs> Then I require an analysis of the shrink spice. Tell me what is in it, and be quick about it. Please. Hmm, ah, yes. A poultice made in the herbological traditions of the mother. <laughs> Though its purpose I cannot condone. If that is what you desire, then one will enter the olfactory realm to find the answers you see. So she's gonna sniff it. What? Don't sniff. I know that. That's a chemistry thing, yeah. <sighs> so many subtle aromas. Witch hazel, cinnamon, uh, black tea. Each a natural remedy for inflammation. And among these astringents. <coughs> uh. Oil of vitriol. Oil of vitriol? That's sulfuric acid. A common but powerful desiccant. That certainly explains the burning sensation. Floofty, did you tell the journalist to throw acid at you? <laughs> well, this has been surprisingly not a waste of time. I am going to leave now. I may call on your services again. And you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Spoiler. Well, this is the this this is that's the core game. This is the DLC. No boom yumsies! But yeah, Vahlok, I don't know. What is it? <laughs> What's the answer to the riddle? Chandler wants to talk oh, to you. I suppose it was only a matter of time. Tell Chandler I will be with him shortly. Are we here to speak ill of my brother? I will gladly go first. Complaint one of 294. Jeez. No, no, that's not why I asked you here. But I do want to talk about Snorpy. He wasn't like this when we were kids, right? I mean, he wasn't always so on edge, was he? Snorpington has always had his imagination and his moral compass. But no, I suppose he's gotten markedly more distraught since our project's dissolution. What happened between you two? I mean, I heard some of it from him, but I always wanted to hear your side too. And Snorpy doesn't really like me talking to you. Oh, I'm aware. I have a pile of threatening letters to that effect. <laughs> However, I will gladly take this opportunity to set the record straight. We were working together on a government-funded research project. Advanced prosthetics that are ten times stronger than an ordinary grumpus. But our dear Snorpington discovered that the government had less than savory plans for that technology. And despite my protestations, he tried to make those plans public knowledge. Well, yeah, I don't blame him. Even you got to admit, that's pretty jacked up, dog. Am I the world's only optimist? That technology would have saved lives. 
If it must either exist with some consequences or not exist at all, I think the choice is clear. Easy to say when you aren't the one living with the consequences. Oof. Yeah, where did you come from? Shoo! <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunately, Snorpington agreed with you. He tried to play whistleblower, but before he could make a sound, we were both fired. And after that, there was a campaign to slander both of us, to discredit any allegations he might still make. So, there really was a conspiracy against you two? <laughs> if you must call it that. But only the most boring sort with paperwork and lawsuits. Still, that means it's not all in his head. Don't mistake justification for reason. Snorpington has moved well beyond the realities of our situation. All right, Floofy. Thanks for telling me all that. Mm, happy to have enlightened you. Honestly, I expected this conversation to involve more shouting and head loss. <laughs> no, not this time. We're cool. But hey, we should talk more often. And maybe I can show you how to headlock me. Perhaps. <laughs> but for now, my work beckons. <laughs> Gentle is great, dude. I love him. Not creepies! No! <sighs> Go make some actual yumsies. Besides, cream pies, cream pies are fun to eat. They're more fun to eat than... <laughs> that just sounds so bad. No, you know, I take it back. I take it... No, no, just... No, they're bad. I don't, I don't want a cream pie. All right, so let's see what you would look like full celly sticks mode. Oh, no. <laughs> you look so thin and weak like this. Cream pies are nice, right? No, 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 no. Hey, Lax, how's it going? All right, what about the... What was the other one that he wanted? He wanted the pie, right? <laughs> I'm not a fan of like the tin body, but other than that, I like the whole like pie and pecan theme. Yeah, the tin body just kind of kills it for me, but the rest of this looks pretty fun. <laughs> I like it. Favorite pie? Mine is either pumpkin or pecan, actually. I like both a lot. Probably pumpkin might be my favorite. I love pumpkin pie. Ask Triffany to talk to Channel. Unfortunately, Triffany's like all the way out there somewhere. I gotta go find her. I love how that tracking thing was active the whole time, by the way. Like in the cutscenes and everything, it was just always active. It's not butt pie! And no cream pies near the butt. I'm not yumsies. All right, someone wants to talk to you. I've completed the maze. Well, that too. We hit the archaeological jackpot! Let's go inside, sugar scan pie? around, and see just what kind of ruin this is. What's a sugar pie? I mean, isn't every pie a sugar pie? <laughs> Can we talk? Chandler wants to talk oh, to you. I'm happy to chat with Chandlo. Let's meet by the Not campfire. Newsies. All right, campfire time. What's going mm -hmm. on, Chandlo? Triffany. You know about history and like ancient society. Nah, dude, I'm changing his skin. I don't like that tin Shilda body. said Snorpy's lost in a maze of delusion. But what if it's not a delusion? What if there really is a Grumpinati? Well, I've done some research on my own, and uh, near as I can tell, there's no such thing. At least not in the way you see in the movies. There's no shadowy cabal secretly in control of the world. Mm. Real conspiracies can't happen. And heck, there was an old literary society called the Grumpinati. But aside from the name, it's not at all what Snorpy talks about. Are you sure? I mean, I've seen Snorpy's charts and they kind of make sense. Kinda is the important word here, though. Look. There are points of data on that chart that are real, but it's all those strings between them that are made up. No, those are real. We got them from Gramble. Oh, Chandlo, <laughs> that's not, uh, what I... Up, 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 let it go, my child. Point is, Snorpy might be a talented engineer, but he's no historian, and he's certainly not immune to bias, you know? Yeah. I guess you're right. I hope you're right. Thanks for talking to me, Triff Dog. No problem. And if you ever want to know more about failed conspiracies throughout history, you know where to find me. I wish I could change them back to their non-bug snack state. 
I honestly... I kind of want to change Chandler back to how he looked before I started feeding him so much. But I don't think I can. I think he's stuck like this. Well, we'll go back to Mama Melon at least. The look kind of suits him. He's Melon Boy. I do hope they don't break up. There's no way. Come on. They were made for each other. And it's super romantic and adorable. It's not Carl Pine Yumsies! No, no salty cream pie! It's when it starts unsettling just a bit. No, her job. Yeah, I get ya. I get ya. I kind of, I guess, got used to it. I don't really, like, process it much anymore. So what are we gonna do now? Bro, I feel like there's a huge weight on top of me. And it's not the kind I can lift. Snorpy never would have come to Snack Tooth if I didn't push him into it. All I do now is make him exercise and ignore all the stuff I don't understand. Sheldon's right. I don't know enough to really help him. And thinking I do is only making it worse. I'm gonna stay here. Until everybody's ready anyway. I need some time to just think. Okay, we'll give him some time then. Do you even remember what he looked like? Yeah! I do. Like he had like those teeth tusks and I mean he was green, just like this. And he had that hat. He had like a, was it a backwards cap, I think? I I, I kinda remember. Garth and Yumsy, the Yumsy that could. Oh, how normal Yumsies can't do what he would. Some would say he tastes so good, but we all know that he tastes the best. So much that he breaks the rhyme, but with the booty so thick, so he so all good numbers, I'm not Yumsies! Never in yumsies! And not in yumsy! Not in yumsy that could! And not butt thick! Neither of those are true. These are false allegations. How dare you, Drew? <laughs> Look how much exercise I'm getting right now. Not thick. No butt yumsies. Hello. Recesses where large numbers of grumpus slept. This pillar seems to represent leaders of the past. Huh. This huge fire must have kept the cave system warm. Ancient Brigiers, set up by ancient Grumpuses to easily spread fire. The trip shot can fit on top. Cave in that has sealed the chamber beyond here. Hmm. Judging by what we've seen, I'd say this was a communal living space. One of the few that wasn't utterly destroyed anyway. And gosh, technology and culture are so much more advanced than what we've seen so far. This city must have been the center of Stone Grumpus society. And at the very center, the temple, possibly led by a priestess of Mother Nature. A. Who do you think is the bottom in the relationship? Definitely Sprinkle, but... You think that the butt is only maybe just a little bit numsy sometimes, Keelan. No, don't put me in a bite and bake me. You can't numb me that way. Why the mazes? Hmm, that's a great question. There's definitely easier ways to lock a door. <laughs> But seeing as this was the height of their craftsmanship, it's possible they built those mazes just to show off. Tell me about Mother Nature. I don't know too much, but I'll say it's one of the world's oldest practicing religions. I'm sure Shelda could tell you more about it, but on that subject, it's odd I never saw hide nor hair of Mother Nature back on Snack Tooth. It's possible she showed up relatively late in their culture, adding to the existing worship of bug snacks. Hmm. Should we explore the temple? Oh, I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> never look a gift temple in the gateway, as Grandma used to say. <laughs> I'll meet you by the entrance, yeah? <laughs> All right, we'll go. You think that based on experience? What are you? What are you trying to say? <laughs> what? What experience? What? What kind of experience? How? What? What are you? What does that even mean? No! No! The butt only maybe just a little sometimes because because there are exceptions to most rules. And it sometimes there are exceptions in which the butt can be only maybe just a little bit yumsy sometimes. No, you can't sell me as a pie yumsy. You cannot have a garo pie! That's not on the menu. Wait, where did Triffany go? I think I derped. Oh yeah, she's over here. Wait, I have an idea. I have an idea. What food do you like? Hot sauce and cheese. All right, come here. We're low on hot sauce. We use cheese. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. Keep coming. 
That's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant to do. Lift me. No! Oh, oh yeah, yeah, but, but, but... Nice! Nice! Wait, 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 wait! Okay, now come over here. This is how we're gonna spread the fire. Alright. Dry usage always means no bottom. Exactly. What exceptions? Not shankable ones! That you compared your action as a bottom to his and made the educated guess of being a I don't have any actions at the bottom! What are you trying to say? Snowbutt bosses are not a bottom! They're not gay! There is no action at the bottom to be compared to! I just made observations based on their behavior and how they usually talk, and therefore I deduced that that sprinkle butt is probably the bottom in the relationship, okay? That's all there is to it. Is that all I can do? I was hoping I... I still haven't figured out how to spread the fire to the main area. Hmm. No, not shake as a bottom! Also, how do I deal with you? Giant Nugget Shell's shell far too big to carry, tough enough for pregnant with a bug size. Way to crack it open. Spaghetti. Oh, it's a spaghetti. Pulls its brain to the canopy with its noodles. Never don't look up. What do you like? You like cheese. What happens if I put cheese here? Do you not care? I'm not sure how to get that one. I might have to be a little bit more strategic about it. No, not power bottom bump. Can you imagine Chandler being the bomb? I, I, I can't actually. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm analyzing this situation correctly. <laughs> oh hey, you can see the camp from up here, at a nice, safe distance. What do you mean? Anywho, there should be a mechanism <gasps> here to get us through that door. Might be a bit of a jog though. Mm, no, I think I'm good. Can I use this? I still can't get fire back to the beginning area. I must have missed something. I don't think it would take this long to be able to get fire to the beginning area. No, 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 stop! Got it. Perfect. In we go. No, I'm not part of our zenith! Ah, oh, they hate fire. You guys suck. Give me a moment. I'm going to handle this. Bunger, bunger, bunger. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Okay. Go, 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 go. I'm in. <laughs> she just teleported here. <laughs> nice. Way to go. That was some fancy footwork. Ooh. Oh, wow. This is a bit of a okay. maze. Okay. This time, the ancient architects were definitely showing off. But you know, this ludicrously complex maze tells me that whatever's in the temple beyond is just that important. So you know the drill. Let's get to solving. Let's go. You love the ice dragon boy? Thank you. That's very sweet. All right. Looks like the maze starts here. Oh, gosh. That's going to mashy me. Don't mashy. Okay. Bong, drag. I feel like this room needs a soundtrack. I'm like not moving. Something interesting should be happening right now. Okay. Okay. Oh no. There we go. Music. No, get out of there. Okay. All right, good, 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 good. That ant has the capability to throw me out. We don't want that to happen, so be careful. Okay. I think I'll be fine. Patience, patience, patience. 
Butt camp for 69k points. <laughs> what, 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 what? It just makes this screen pop up? You spend the points to make the screen pop up, but then you can't see the gameplay. Have you played Spyro? Yes, I have. Didn't finish though. Oh geez, don't get mashed up there. Careful. No, 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 re. Try again. I think this is mistimed. We're out of sync. Okay, now. I think it'll move forward by the time I get there. Hopefully. Guess not. Wait a little bit longer. Alright, now we should be in sync. Yeah. Oh my... I hate mazes! Face cam? She just a butt cam? So how is that gonna work? It's just the butt in the corner. It, we lose all expressiveness. It's just butt. Or do you mean that like there'll be the butt and then the face is just on the butt? Wait. Oh, I was about to be so mad. I thought I... I thought I had to redo that whole section. Got it. Oof. Got it. Nice Jeez. Job. <laughs> you know, it took all my willpower not to just jump in and do it myself. And how exactly Anywho, would you do that? <laughs> the way is open, so let's get going. Yeah, let's go. You love to see gameplay. Sorry. Yes. Well, the <laughs> that's a kick in the teeth. So much for seeing the temple. Aww. Judging by the bodies, this collapse must have happened when folks were still living here. Maybe the crater is connected somehow. Maybe. Come to think of it, we didn't find a single corpse back in the commune. Where'd all those grumpuses get to? I don't know. Well then, I'm not about to let this mystery go unsolved. I've just got to roll up my sleeves and clear this rubble myself. You, you literally can't do this alone. Oh no, no, we don't need to trouble everybody with all this. I know my way around ruins. I'll be just fine on my own. You just leave this to me. Go on about your day, and I'll have it done in a jiff, okay? Okay. What do we do now? Please do a gameplay with Spyro? Uh, maybe, maybe. I mean, I've kind of got a lot on my play right now, but yeah, it could maybe happen in the future. I tried to do a little bit of Spyro, and people didn't really seem to be very interested, so I kind of moved on past it. We've got fire over there. Why can't we transfer it to the other side? Wigglies, so we're starting to run low on time. So we'll have it done in a GIF! GIF, not YIF! YIF is bad! No YIF! This is a platonic expedition. We're doing scientific research. Ooh, thanks for meeting me out here. I guess if it's just you and me, <laughs> I can keep it casual. <laughs> oh, the front entrance to this place looks too strenuous for these old bones. But I believe there's a side entrance into the shrine. When you find it, can you please open it for me? I think I did that already, didn't I? Maybe I didn't. Come here. What? I don't know. You said I. W why would I know what such a dark word would mean? I have an innocent mind. I would never... No, no, no. I just read what you wrote. That's all. I don't know what it means. Ah, this place. It's almost identical to the shrines I used to visit in my youth. But it's been twisted. Corrupted. Here, Mother Nature is the bringer of bug snacks. The stories they passed down. The warnings about the toxin. They must have come from experience. The shrines of your youth? Yes, the place where I learned about the beauty and wisdom of this world. I hear it's a parking lot now. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> this is the mother's no. original form. The mother is a purest light, 
Her ageless wisdom vastly predates these vile monstrosities. But her followers are a different story. No one starts life off the path. That's why we all need guidance. What stories? I grew up hearing stories about the dangers of Snacktooth Island. Passed down through the oral tradition from those who survived it. Not that many did survive it. Just enough to give one very clear message. The toxin must not be consumed. Well, you consumed it. <laughs> Why not consume the toxin? Because it will lead to your doom. What doom? I, I do not know. The story has gotten frustratingly vague over time. Hmm. Why didn't you tell us this? I did! Every day at the top of my lungs! It's all of you who didn't listen. Why'd you come here? It wasn't really a raffle, I can tell you that. <sighs> come with me to the crater. There's something else I want to see. Maybe she really does know something about this place. Yes. Gameplay of Donut County? What's Donut County? Oral tra It's not a- Whoa! It's not the- I don't have an oral tradition! It's not- Oral tradition means it's stories passed down from generation to generation. Where, like, the grandpa and grandma tell their children and grandchildren what happened. And then they pass it to their grandchildren several decades later, okay? That's oral tradition. Oral tradition is not sucky sucky! And I don't do that anyway! What are we looking for? Yes. This is the place. In the story, they call this island Broken Two. So the story goes, the toxin's influence grew so great and powerful that the sun itself went dark. And so Mother Nature unleashed her wrath on her errant followers, purging the toxin and sending everything to the depths of the ocean. Hmm. I'm sensing a bot. But that story never sat right with me. Destroying followers who stray? That isn't the mother I know. She's not the bringer of bug snacks either. The ancients can't even get their story straight. So what am I supposed to believe? If I can't rely on the wisdom of those past, then all that's left is my own experience. I need to meditate. Child, if you would do me a kindness. You see that egg, Lachelle? I need you to crack open three of them. This time, it's not a metaphor. Okay. Well, I already cracked one. Not sucky, sucky, shakeable. I think grandparents would tell that story to children. It's not that kind of story. Oral tradition means, I don't use my mod! Okay, yeah, I use my mod to pass on a tradition. But it's words. It's vocal. It's speech. It's not... It's not... It's not sense of touch, it's the sense of hearing, okay? Hearing, not touch, not sucky, no not butts. It's an indie video game. Up time, yeah, we do need to wrap things up soon, Wigglies. <sighs> Wigglies, here's the thing. I kind of want to make videos on bug snacks, and I kind of need to finish this as quickly as possible. Does it, yes, it, yes, 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 yes. It's words, it's only words. You bad, you bad, it's only words. Anyways, as I was saying, I can't actually grab that thing. Oh, shoot, dude. Oh, <laughs> I kind of want to finish the game like ASAP, but I'm not sure. People are going to have to go to sleep if I try to push to complete it today. Like, Valak, you're going to bed soon, aren't you? Get in the water. Okay, now we should be able to move it. Setting it on fire prevented us from moving it, so that was a bad move. No! I messed up. Yeah, okay. Well, I don't want you to miss out. But that might mean... I might have to not do Overwatch 2 tomorrow, then. Or I might do Bug Snacks until it's completed. Honestly, I, I was having a lot of fun in VR chat, but we probably shouldn't have spent so much time there as enjoyable as it was because I really really wanted to finish this I want to make vids on this game mm -hmm. get it up re there <laughs> welcome back shadow 202 p.m. all right all right fine 
I'm just gonna get this egg and wrap things up. Still don't know how to set these things on fire. I might look into it off stream. Never see what you enjoy with your fog. I don't want to finish it at the expense of your enjoyment or the enjoyment of other Wigglies. I would be going to bed soon. Shouldn't take that long. Yeah, I don't think it would take too long. Honestly, if I had just done VR chat sooner, I think we would have gotten the show on the road, but it is what it is. Because I can't play with you, most likely. Do you think this DLC is long? No, I don't think so. I really think a couple more hours and I would complete it, but... People would miss out on the experience if I did that. But then I'd be able to start making videos on it, which I do want to do. So I'm conflicted. Check Donut County. Who need to go to otherwise? Oh, is that wooden chair? No! Moral tradition! No! You're, you're, how, what kind of moral tradition could you even possibly have? What stories would you have to share, huh? Something about your culture? You have something to tell me about your culture, what your people did in ancient times? How, just how ancient would these times be, huh? <laughs> Love you so much, I precious well, lovely. You need to get some rest yourself, too. I need to work, man. I need to work sleep. Let me just find the last egg. Where egg? Where is egg? I must find egg. Egg, 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 and egg. Egg, 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 and egg. If I use the blob and take it out. I mean, I will put the whole playthrough on YouTube, but I know it's not the same as experiencing it together live. Re, why couldn't they release on a Friday? Didn't the spider have it? Ah, oh, heck! You're right! The spider has the egg! <sighs> the smooch is my old tradition. <laughs> I love practicing that oral tradition. We should do it more often. But does it have to be oral to oral? The egg is not in my butt. Other locations can make contact. The British Empire. Alright, okay, let me see. How... Hmm. Can we spread fire to you? I tried shoot... He likes cheese, right? Supposedly. <laughs> I just covered him in cheese. <laughs> he doesn't care. Wait! What if I put cheese on you? Will you snatch it? Okay, what if I put cheese on the chocolate? I feel like it's not supposed to get the egg, dude. I think I messed something up. Alright, let's use the power of fire. Try covering something in cheese. Apparently that's not it. Nobody supposed to Spanish Inquisition. Oh, why don't I just do this? Let's see how good you are at- wait, I don't think I can throw it that high. I can't. Well, that's awkward. <laughs> I might clip into him with this. No. Come on. Why does it not go where it says it's gonna go? What the heck is this aiming? Okay. Well, that's not good. It's like they coded it to make it really difficult to hit it. Alright, you know what? You can bounce it, can't you? Bounce what? You know what? Okay, I don't want to stall this anymore. People need to go to sleep. Um, I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do. I was legit hoping to start making vids on this, but I kind of need to finish it. But then if I finish it early, people are going to miss out on the experience. <gasps> I did it! Huh. Get that spider! Get him! Oh, this is your master hunter. <laughs> Got it. Mine, mine, don't take that egg. No! It's my egg! 
I mean, I didn't lay it, it but it belongs to me. All right, we're good. Did it. Watch that string spice. Yes. Normal hunter of males. All right, I did it. Let's hear what she has to say, and then we're wrapping up. I've cracked the shells. Oh, thank you. I know that wasn't an easy task. Yeah, it really wasn't. Ah, bug snacks are so often in the shape of unliving things, but somehow these shells are just shells. They're also the only good source of calcium on this island. But, but, but don't judge me. <laughs> I'm fighting osteoporosis. <laughs> ah, anyway, I've centered my thoughts. I want to know for myself what bug snacks are, whether they're of the mother or not. I'm going to need that big old nasty flying bug snack. Please, bring it to the box of purity when you get the chance. <laughs> well, I have one. We can go do that very quickly. You check out Donut County. I, I, I don't know. I don't know anything about that game. I don't agree to play games that I know nothing about. I'd have to look into it. I've kind of got a lot on my plate as it is, though, so it probably wouldn't be soon. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's that way, right? I still don't know how to ignite that. How do we transfer fire? We can't use one of the living bug snacks for it. Oh, I'm such an idiot. There's a campfire. Oh, my gosh. I'm such an idiot. Oh my lord, dude. I, okay. So, what is this? Thank you. I swear I'm not going to eat it this time. I don't believe you. Nay, for I see <laughs> the very essence of bug snacks. That spirit which drives them to create their poisonous delights. You know, Unfortunately, I, I have no grump and clue how to do that. You're right. You know why? Because I just smote someone I care for who really deserves it. You're a cutie. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can make suggestions in Discord. That is correct. You could ask Floofy. <gasps> Floofy? Are you out of your grumping mind? One would never consult with that wicked alchemist. You say, what would Mother Nature do? Grow a tree. But I can't do that right now. But one must admit, when it comes to delving into the forbidden, the forbidden, there is none more bold than Floofty. Forbidden. Oh well, if that is how it must be, then may the mother protect. Okay, I promise this is the last thing. I'm sorry for taking so long. I oh, promise this is it. You seem to be dangerously close to my personal space. If you're here to trap me in a spell circle again, I will inform you that I could leave at any time and I was merely acting. <laughs> Temper your contemptuous heart. <laughs> One is here on a quest for understanding to unlock the forbidden knowledge of bug snacks. Oh, and you've come to me. Why don't you ask your mother naturally? Or Crystal or whatever you talk to. The path is shrouded at the moment one believes that clearing this impasse requires a more scientific lens how interesting are you certain i'm given to understand that i exude a fetid order of utter evil from every pore you are reckless and arrogant and so so rude but one does not truly believe that you are evil <laughs> Well, I have little time nor patience for your games. If you want to know something, stop speaking like a horoscope and ask. Ugh. I want to know the essence of bug snacks. What is it they're made of? If I can understand that, then I might know whether they're actually separate from Mother Nature or born from the darkness of her history. I'm not about to resolve your philosophical quandaries. There is no answer to the why of the universe. Bug snacks simply exist. However, since you've finally taken an interest in my studies, then just this once I will educate you. I can show you how to extract live snack matter for microscopic viewing without that matter denaturing. Ah, but if I were to explain it to a very small infant, denaturing is... I know what denaturing means. <clears throat> you do? I'm here to learn about bug snacks. Not vocabulary. Ah, uh -huh. very well then. Our lesson should proceed smoothly. 
Step one of 17, preparing an adequate formalin solution. Thank you for encouraging this old lady to learn something new. Aww. Now you better leave us to it. I sense this may take a while. <laughs> all right, all right. So I moved to fire here. I was an absolute derp. I didn't realize you could get it from the campfire. We have this adorable pie still waddling around on its little pie legs. I think we can actually go ahead and open this. So let's do that real quick. And apparently for our NPC quest, all that's left is to go check on... Uh, what's her face? What? Oh, we have to be a little bit smarter. Can I light that campfire? Yay! I sure can. All right, now. Light this. What does this do? What have I done? Oh. What's this? It's a key. A strange triangular key. What sort of space might this open? I don't know. What's back there? Oh no! This is bad. I fell in a crack. I'm stuck. No! No, 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 no. Oh no. But they added fast travel to the game, right? Can I get out? Oh, heck me. Help. Yes. Help me. Oh, I'm gonna have to like fast travel out and back in, aren't I? All right, fine. <laughs> well, that's a bit of a problem. <laughs> you can get stuck in that little crack. <laughs> it's okay. That's what fast travel's for. Thank you for adding fast travel. I didn't really need fast travel. I just needed a way to get out of a soft lock. <laughs> funny. Dragon by Cactus stuck with these. No, the pausies aren't stuck. I got out. I fast traveled out. I just don't know what we do with that key that we just got. I never saw a locked door. Maybe we'll see one later. Well, let's go check on Triffany. She's gonna... We're gonna go check on Triffany. Cold fast travel, yes. It's not Boomgasm! Chedorb doesn't approve of your Boomgasm, and neither does the Chocolant. 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 Triffany was an iron. <laughs> Dude, I would feast on that pie bug snacks. I love pecan pie. I would shove my head in all that pecan goo. <laughs> I don't know about celery boy. I don't really care too much for that. Mochi is pretty yummy. I would like to have some mochi. I know where that key is for. Where does the key go? Tell me. Open the pie already. Oh, I'm not dragon pie. Oh, Bugstacks is great. I highly recommend the game. Definitely buy it. All right, I'm here. Any luck with the rubble? Doesn't look like it. Oh, it's not going too good. I'm starting to worry. I might never see the inside of this temple. Okay. Maybe Fluchi could figure something out? No one them. They go and whip up some chemical that dissolves rocks and only takes three-fourths of their blood to make. It's safer for them if I don't ask. Yeah, I get you. Shelda? I could be, but I don't know that I need even more riddles to solve. Besides, I've heard the sounds her back makes. She could really use a lie down. So you're just worried about everyone Shendla? I don't know. Maybe he could. But if I put him in any danger, Snorpy's gonna hear about it. And then I'll hear about it every day for the rest of my life. <laughs> okay, can we work together? Oh, I was afraid you'd say that. Sure, teamwork would really help out here. But those grumps can't go more than an hour without starting a big fight. And I, uh, I just freeze up. You know, I'm an expert in my field and all. But I'm not a management type. It's better if I just concentrate on my work and... Let them cool off on their own. Wait, my voice... Oh, no. Well, it's fixed now. You really don't think they can cooperate? No, I don't. These kind of spats, they just fester and grow. And before you know it, civilization collapses. Look, some folks just don't get along. Some mysteries just go unsolved. There's nothing I can really do about it. But at least we gave it a shot. I'll see you back at camp. We can't give up that easily. But we finished everybody's quest. I'm sure we're going to be able to progress something now. But yeah, where does the key go? No, not cel <laughs> celery. But what? She just went poof. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she just vanished. No, no Millie Mochi. I guess that's supposed to be like a millipede combined with mochi. We have Bunga Royale, Chocolant, the Devil Eggler. <laughs> I love how, like, 
propels itself with its like eggshell fragments. <laughs> it's so adorable. Secret area? Where's the secret area? Garo doesn't need to hear all this. He's a highly trained professional known from his work at Black Mesa. Exactly. Professional pauses. Pro pauses. You got that right. Millimochi. No! No, don't Millimochi me! No! I don't want any Millimochi on me. Alright, I helped everyone. Can we do something now? We've all finished investigating. Oh, that's nice. Well, if that's the case, then I'm gonna go gather everybody up so we can share what we all learn. <gasps> Climax this time. This might be a long meeting. So let me know if you've still got some business to do. I think this is a sort of point of no return thing. All right, let's get started. Fantastic. All right, everybody. Team meeting. Dang, dude, I should have gone Thanks just a little bit longer meeting, yesterday. Everybody. It seems like we've all had an interesting time so far, yeah? Indeed. I must say I'm eager to see what grisly curiosities you found in your studies, Professor. Oh, ah... Uh... I better not go first. I'm sure I'll just ramble on all night. <laughs> Say, Chandlo, did you ever find a way to get bigger? Not physically, nah. But I did grow in, like, a metaphorical way. <laughs> Sorry I couldn't help more with the science. Do not apologize, child. Knowing oneself is the most valuable kind of knowing. Hmm. And Shilda... What did you find out about Mother Nature, eh? With some... <clears throat> additional insight, one has learned that bug snacks are indeed children of the mother. Oh, dang. Yet toxins still. Just as every fang dripping with venom, every flower glistening with poisonous sap. A reminder that nature can be very unkind. Hmm. Trump, yeah! Nature's hardcore! <laughs> uh, like some, the ancients may have worshipped the mother, but her light was lost on them. The tooth remains broken, and one believes that this was not the work of the divine. The truth of its destruction and rebirth remains shrouded. That is so interesting! Oh, I swear, we've got to talk about history soon, Sheldon. But first, let us discuss my findings. <laughs> With some <clears throat> minor assistance, I was able to reproduce the newly discovered shrink spice. After some experimenting, I've learned that these big bug snacks are actually small by default. Something about the snack matter on this island causes them to enlarge. I believe I understand the how, but I've yet to discover the why. There is no why, Flutely. Things simply are. Using my words against me. Invent your own wisdom, you sagacious charlatan. <laughs> I would if you ever listened to anybody but yourself. No, don't fight. Oh, please, let's not start. <laughs> <laughs> What's that happening now? Ha, oh, you missed it, Drift Dog. Lufty and Shelda teamed up to brain slam this mystery. They... they have? Shocking, I know. The things I do for science. Yes, the path is ever winding. But one apologizes for the distraction, as it is time to feast on the fruits of the historian's knowledge. Oh, well, hmm. I... I've certainly learned a lot, but... There are still plenty of mysteries abound, and I think it's possible we'll find all the answers inside the temple. Unfortunately, there's a bit of a collapsed hallway there, and I've got no way to get through. I believe we may have a solution for that. My combined research with Shelda has produced something quite useful indeed. Oh, yeah! Floofty asked me to build Don't a- Don't ruin the surprise. Trust me, it will be very entertaining. Ooh. A more ominous sentence has never been uttered. Well, that all sounds good to me. Let's head to the temple. I wonder what they built. We're going to find out well, in a moment. There it is. Think you can do something about this debris? No problem, Drift Dog. Floofty, let's get the thing ready. Of course, the thing. <laughs> the you, thing. Place your buggy ball on the ground in front of us. Oh. 
Your mind is my mind is focused on apologies and butthole. Thank you. Valak! Good to see you, my precious Valak Wiggly. Hope you're doing well. Alright, put the ball. Good. Now turn around. And no peeking. What? We wouldn't want to ruin the surprise, would we? Why am I the only one that doesn't get to see it? I've got it out of the ball. What? Slippery little thing. Keep it still or the needle will Ow! What the grump is that stuff? You'll live. There we go. And did you turn it? Whoa! Don't let go! Oh no, you don't! Let me turn around! Gotcha! You may now turn around. Did you turn right, Strabby? Feast your eyes on the big. new and improved. Big Puggy Ball! I wanted to call it the Engorged Strabiform or Bacula Encasement. We can't always get what we want. With this much snack power, we can hit down! What have you done ball. to Sprout? What am I gonna tell Gramble? We injected Sprout with growth hormones, and now he's huge. At least now I can, like, ram into my fellow Grumpuses. Ow. Oh. Ow. Oh. Ow. <laughs> First got try. Nice. Strabby, come back! Everybody. I can't, I Call can't do anything. Sold. You are all very welcome. <laughs> oh yeah! Big Strabby! His name is Sprout! Send to yourself, Chandlo. This is not a creation <laughs> to be celebrated, but to be feared. Yeah, but we did do pretty good, huh? Ooh. I could ask a million questions about how that works. But first things first, let's poke around in these ruins. Maybe we'll find the locked door in there. Wonder if that works on something else, huh? What exactly would we use it on, huh? Irish! Gifting a sub to Unknown Muse. All oh, the exclamation mark, I have a chat for Irish. Just gifted subs to Unknown Muse. Unknown Muse, you get all the Gar emotes. Enjoy those emotes. Enjoy the sub badge next to your name. No, it's not Shango will play with Big Ball! What is this? A great big hole in the center of the room, completely sealed. Maybe we can break it open. Mm -hmm. Should I talk to you? No, no. There's oh, nothing. Now. This mural depicts the ancient Grumpus's readying a ceremony. Some guy in water. A solar eclipse? Oh. This mural depicts a Grumpus being sacrificed to a great maw? <gasps> they sacrificed people to the bug snacks! No! The bug snacks are yumsies! People are not yumsies! Oh no, that's bad. Whoa, this part has you interested, huh? Did you yes. like my April Fool's video? Alright, well, what's this? This huge statue of Mother Nature watches over the chamber. That's Mother Nature? What is this? The statue's been utterly destroyed. Was this the leader of the ancient Grumpuses? I don't know. This is a bad place. That's an understatement. <laughs> I told you that the stone grumps did ritual sacrifice, yeah? Well, this was the place. They'd throw grumpuses down that pit, offering them up to oh, whatever's down there. Hmm. Is that why the bug snacks here get so big? Because the soil's been uniquely fertilized? Ugh, with grumpus bodies? Huh? <laughs> That's the sacrifice thing pro- wait, no, no, it's not. I found this machine thing buried here. Kind of reminds me of Snorpy's lunch pads. Indeed, yet large enough to launch something of significant size. In fact, it seems to be perfectly suited for the big buggy ball. I believe an experiment is in order. Okay. Where exactly are we launching this thing? A massive stone machine that locks round objects in place. A trigger on the back launches its payload to the target. Get in there. <laughs> Whoa! Sprout got locked in there! Uh, now what? Hmm. There seems to be a triggering mechanism on the back. It may require a jolt from the snack grappler to activate. Okay. We can do that. Easy. Whoa. 
That's like a catapult. Oh, no. That can't be a good sign. What did you all do? Uh, we broke rocks. The disturbance is emanating from the sealed pit. <gasps> Ready yourself. It's the number. A grave danger approaches. Frost. I get the feeling I'm about to get dunked on again. <laughs> oh my gosh! Smorgasbord. What is that shadowboard? Oh. Sprout. <laughs> my friend. <laughs> ah! <laughs> The king of the jungle rolls Chet Orbs as an attack. Its lid protects its cheesy back. It's a giant cheese thing. Oh no. Okay, okay, I have an idea. We have to throw the orbs at him if we don't have Sprout. What do they like? What do they like? I need to lure it here. Oh. Yes. Launch it. Launch the cheese. Launch the cheese. Yay. Good, good, good. More. Oh. We don't want to shrink them. We don't want to use that spice. Get them here. Get them here. Oh. Yes. Launch the cheese. No. Yes. Bang. <laughs> it looks like a cheesy delight in there. They sacrificed Grumpuses to that thing. He smashed it. Wait, we don't have any more. Whoa. Rocks. Yay. Oh, gosh. I didn't realize my teammates got wrecked. What do I do? Oh. Go right here. It's not budging. Well, I don't know what to do. Maybe the Cheddar can break it. Come here. No, it's not doing anything. Mm. We. Oh! No, 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 no. I'm not Yumsies or a giant cheese thing. <laughs> oh. oh, please. Is that so well? You're being prepared for a monster challenge, or you'll get jacked until you're black and blue. Good luck. Thanks. Lots of cheese. This game turns to turn bright and happy place something very dark. Yes, yes, it does. What am I supposed to do? Wait. I need something small, right? But how am I gonna get them in this hole? Oh. Wait. I don't know why, but it suddenly broke through. Okay, good, good, good. Now get in the hole. I don't know what I did. <laughs> get in the... No, 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 no. Stop. 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 Please. Ow. I don't know how I was able to take a boulder to the face. Yes, this way. Yes. Fire! Yay! Oh, that didn't break it, and that was my last one. That's a problem. Wait, no, there's another one over here. Come. Come here, Cheddar Orb. Yes. Fire! Yes! How many times do I have to do this? Oh, he's a Cheddar Bortle Rex. Oh, okay. I need him to check it over here. Come here. Throw a cheddar this way. Do it! Throw him! Run! Quickly! Yes! How many times? Oh, he didn't like that. Jeez. There's another one over here. Throw it! Throw him! Yes! No! He was in the way! What? Ah! Please! No! No, no! Throw one here! Yes, yes, throw! 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 Fire! You missed! Ah! Stop! Okay. Throw a cheddar orb here now. Cheddar orb. Throw it. No, don't launch it. <laughs> throw the big cheese here. Fire! Cheese! 
Wait, the hole! I can't move. What do I do now? Strabby's back! No, 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 come here! Don't take him! He's mine! Destroy! You can't throw him if I destroy him. Ah! Where does he need to go? Wait, I can't deploy him. What's going on? Wait. Oh, okay. That scared me. Get in there. No! Get in! Hey! Give him back! <laughs> Give him back to me! That's my friend! Strabby, go! Sprout! Get in there! Get in! Wait, I think you need to go in from here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Solve the puzzle. Yes, yes. Faster! Go on, yes, yes. Oh, it's getting closer to me. Yes. Go on. Sprout! Get in the hole! Go! Sprout! Yes. Yes! The big cheese! Get the, get the smoke! The dust! Fire! Now we gotta capture it! Patrol route! Okay, 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 okay. Fine, come back around. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Delicious cheese is all mine. Are his legs made of like knives? Oh dang. Cheddar Portal Rex. Delicious. Bro! I better eat that thing before it pops up again! You just want to eat everything, huh? All right, fine. We'll feed him the cheese. No, don't get sacrificed to the mom, not Yumsy's Drew. All right, here. Get numbs. You're a cheese boy now. Yeah! I don't know if it's the adrenaline talking, but that's the best bug snack I've ever had! You just ate All their right. god. <laughs> Let's check if everybody's okay. We sacrificed bug snack, yeah. Seth. You literally just ate their god. Good to see we're all in one piece. That was the biggest snack I've ever seen. Nothing like a giant monster fight to get the blood pumping. <laughs> Speak for yourself. One is far too old for this. Agreed. But now that the danger is past, I'd like to revisit what precisely all of this means. You know, judging by the temple roof, the collapses, the crater, I mean, it's just a thought, but I think Ages ago, something big came out of that pit. Well, yeah. We just saw the Cheddar Bortle come out of there. <laughs> if the Cheddar Bortle could be handled by one mediocre journalist, I doubt it could destroy an entire civilization. Why are you mediocre? Yeah, I'm thinking much bigger and much nastier. Something we can hardly even imagine. The wrath of Mother Nature. Or perhaps... The wrath of those sacrificed. Amusing as this grisly history is, none of that explains why the island suddenly rose from the sea. Maybe it wanted to be found. Uh, islands don't generally want things, Chandlow. Unless those lost and vengeful lie dormant still beneath our feet. You know, I think I've learned all I can for now. <laughs> what say we call it quits today? For our own good. All yes. right, sounds good to me. Okay, so do you want to come back to the raft with us or keep exploring? Huh. I mean, I guess we're done. There's not much left to explore. All right, we'll go back to the raft then. Wonderful. And on the way, I'll regale you with stories about other temple collapses. We still need to go where that key go uh, figure out where the key goes, dude. Impossible. Love you, Avenger. Wait, before we leave. Oh, Grump. We've been gone so long. I'm gonna call Snorpy the second we get signal again. Hardly because I miss him a lot, 
but also so he knows it's us. So he doesn't try to blow up the raft. What? <laughs> oh, I was gonna try to see what he looked like as a full cheese. It seems like the more we learn about Snacktooth's history, the grimmer it gets. But that's the dark side of archaeology. Civilization never collapses in a nice way. On the bright side, we might have just discovered the historical basis for the myth of Grumplantis. Grandma Lotta Blog would have loved to see this. <laughs> Maybe. You know what? I like your new form. This suits I you. I am skeptical of the idea that Krumpus sacrifice is the true catalyst for snack gigantification. However, this is infeasible and, yes, unethical to test at the moment. Regrettably, I must leave with more questions than answers. However, rest assured that I am by no means finished researching this island. I'm, 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 I'm. <laughs> this is so silly to see that little, like, wooden, like, tuning fork nose just, like, bobbing up and down as she talks in this serious scientific speech. <laughs> Oof, I'm gonna need new bones after this. Uh, <clears throat> but one finally understands the mother's will. Broken tooth is not a vision of the past, but of our future. And you better be ready for it. All right, time to skedaddle. Let's go. Achievements. Oh, yeah. They added achievements to this game. Snorp Dog! Chandler, my l <coughs> um, uh, <laughs> You're in one piece. And I mean, uh, of course you are. I had the utmost faith in you. Oh, please. You were likely in tears the entire time. I was not! <laughs> Trithany, what in the world did you find out there? Oh, gosh. That's a long story. I kind of want to get home to Wamby first, if you don't mind. But, uh, let's meet up in town, and I'll tell you the details over some snack waters, yeah? Yes, let's! Ah, and Shelda's alive and well? Yeah, my joints are killing me. <laughs> but sure. I, uh, uh, one must meditate with a tincture of willow and cloves. <laughs> uh... If you inform me of the recipe, I could find a way to augment the effects. Consider this an effort to be less deliberately antagonistic towards you. <laughs> uh, thanks, I guess. Floofies <laughs> being helpful? Seriously, Chandler, what happened over there? Grumpinati mind control? I don't know. We're just finding ourselves out here, Snorp Dog. And, uh, speaking of that... Snorpy, I'm sorry for making you come to Snack Tooth. Oh, well, well, that's all right. It may not be my favorite place, but, but I know you're just doing what you think is best. Yeah, that's the problem. Well, you sound like you've got something weighing on your mind. Yeah, I do. But I think it can wait. Let's just go home and chill, okay? Ah, ah well, well, I'm nothing if not chill. Thanks for everything, dog. We'll see you back at Snacksburg. Oh, that's really sweet. They're reunited. So that's the DLC, isn't it? We finished it. Wait, does anyone have a hat? Hat? So I wonder what we're going to find behind this locked door. So it's a door that had always been available. You said find destroyed ship, climb on top as possible, and you find secret entrance. Up here? Is Sprout always big, by the way? Ah, oh, he went back to being small. <laughs> what? I would have never found this on my own. What is this place? The triplicate space. Old tape recorder. This tape recorder has been abandoned here for decades, but amazingly, it still works. This is a secret, dude. We found a secret in the game. Well, aren't you an intrepid little journalist? Coming into this secret hideaway just to ask questions of the first stranger you see. Mm. I, too, respect the pursuit of knowledge. And I have been down here. Question me if you dare. 
He's talking to me? A second floor balcony. Related to the Grumpinati? Statue can point three different directions. It seems to affect a few different mechanisms in this room. Can I push it? We probably need to get them to face towards the middle. That just makes the most sense to me. Whoa! Oh, these are magnetic. So they're not the Grumpinati, they're just this organization meant to protect against bug snacks until they can learn to control them? Huh. They just don't start the next tape until you finish the previous one, so listen to every tape. Shoot. Well, I hope I didn't miss any. That's the bug snacks map. I like it. What would have happened if we had all of these pointing to the middle? Nothing. Good thing I... What did, what did that do? Wait, did I listen to this one yet? Yeah, no, I, I did. They made it sound like something happened, but I don't think anything happened? Did I listen to this one? I've been watching your oh. A lot of blog. A lot of blog is. That's the um, historian lady. But I think it's like her mother or grandmother. I'm not sure. Welcome back, Darius. Good to see you. I'm not Yumsies. If they're flashing, that means we haven't interacted with them yet. I don't know what to make of this. Also, I'm a little bit lost. Let's see, I remember going right, so... We probably came from there. Yeah, we need to go left now. Is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This way. Go here. More of these statues. Rotating this ancient statue seems to rotate its neighbors as well. Will something happen when they all face the same direction? Okay, I'll see what I can do.
Okay, we handled that side. Now the other one. Hmm. This doesn't seem too difficult. I did it. Right? Yeah, I did. Oh, another button. We're under the ocean. Yo, there's a Megamaki swimming around down here. The sushi water dragon. Hey GTA, good to see you. I haven't really been keeping count of how many of these logs that we've encountered, but I'm pretty sure I've interacted with every single one that I've seen. There's a new button in the center of the room. No, I'm not getting wet. We're staying inside. Wait, the panel up top was removed, I think. In we go. <laughs> Someone was employee of the month every month, I suppose. Well, wasn't that fun? I will be taking your recordings now. What? You're like dead or gone. You can't do anything. These are all recordings. We're fine. We need to go catch that bug snack, though. Employee of the month. Okay. Do's or do. Collect more water. Hydrate or else. You are not being watched. Maybe. <laughs> you can do it. Coffee. Don't forget your birthday. Bug snacks. Remember, peanut butter is on mountain. Ketchup is a vegetable. Don't eat too many or any bug snacks. Collect more chocolate. Sauce is good. Find non-sauce food. We gotta go get that bug snack, dude. Where'd it go? So why did he record, like, this conversation towards me and, like, these threats, but, like, he can't actually do anything? <laughs> the music is nice, yes. Have a pretty good day? Mm -hmm. That's good. Happy to hear. I didn't get to read that too much because I was, like, listening to the log, but it was saying this bug snack will flee to other parts of the island? So he could be anywhere. I see him! Capu <laughs> Capuchito. Well, the fastest snack alive. When startled, it will flee to an entirely different region of Snack Tooth Island. I named him Joey Quick Beans. He's my best friend. I've been here for a very long time. So we got to make sure we don't mess this up. If we scare him, he's going to run away. Stay stealth. No, don't hit him! Actually, I don't think this is a good angle. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Before he reaches this location. Okay, try again. That tree actually over there would be better. I'm such a derp. Shh. Quiet, quiet, quiet. Okay. No, 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 no. <sighs> no. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, I got it. <sighs> oh, he got scared. He was about to run away. <laughs> there he is, the triplicate space. Interesting cappuccino. So it's like a coffee as a cappuccino, but it's a beetle that runs away. The fastest snack alive when startled will flee to an entirely different region on Snack Tooth Island. Loves chocolate. Oh. Cappuccino! Got him. It's the bug snacks, not the butt snacks. Fog, we got him. Caught every single bug snacks in the game. <laughs> I never did get a real interview with you.
Let's get a better be angle. Yeah. Oh, uh, right, right. Uh, you are a journalist after all. Indeed, I am. Honestly, I'm nothing special, but if you really want to know more about me, I'll answer your questions. Start the interview. Been a while since we did one of these. Let's go. Mm -hmm. So, who are you? <clears throat> Dr. Agabel Batternugget, MD. Okay. What's your medical specialty? Well, in school, I focused on endocrinology. But uh, the clinic I worked at was so small. In practice, I wound up doing family medicine. I think endocrinology, that's like hormone stuff, if I remember correctly. Why come to Snacktooth Island? Come on, you know why. <sighs> Lisbert said I didn't have to come, that she'd be back to see me whenever she could, but I wasn't gonna let myself get left behind. Thoughts on bug snacks? They're a perfectly balanced source of nutrition with upsetting side effects that are otherwise harmless. Okay. All right, doctor, but how do they make you feel? They make me feel like, for a little while, nothing else in the world matters. And that can be nice sometimes. You make it sound like a drug. <laughs> what about my bug snacks allergy? Yeah, that's weird. Why am I allergic? Wait, you're allergic to bug snacks? What have you been eating all this time? That's a good question. <laughs> I'm just always hungry for a scoop. I guess we have been eating sauce, right? I mean, that, I figured that was just some kind of, like, plot armor thing that we weren't really focusing on. I'm just gonna go for the comedic response, but I'm assuming I've probably been eating sauce. This isn't a joke. Malnutrition can lead to muscle atrophy, slowed immune response, and even depression. Mm, I'll give you a checkup once we've brought Liz back home. Oh, that's sweet. Okay. Why'd you leave town? We've covered that already. Elaborate. Oh, well, I guess not. Any info on Lizbert? <laughs> I know everything about Liz, but somehow she's still a mystery to me. It's been like that since day one. How'd you two meet? I was working at my clinic in the middle of nowhere, thinking about how, once again, I didn't have any plans for the weekend. When Elizabeth Megafig literally kicked down my door and immediately passed out. <laughs> wow, what happened? Her injuries were pretty serious. Bone fractures, full body contusions, and way less blood than she ought to have. When she was conscious again, she told me all about her adventures. The ruin collapse that nearly killed her. The treasure of Grumsylvania. Everything. The second she could walk, Liz tried going right back to those ruins. So what'd you do? I couldn't stop her, so I decided to go with her. Just to make sure she'd be okay. And one amazing adventure later, I quit my job and left town with the love of my life. Aw, that's sweet. No more questions, thank you. Oh, we're done? Well, thanks for keeping me company. Hey, uh, you know how to use the projector, right? <gasps> Here, take this. Ooh. It's nice to look back on the good times once in a while, and I think you'd like to see it. Video diary. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll go check well, it out. Well, I'll get back to it. Stay safe out there. Yeah, thank you. Let's go see what she gave us. This one's the new one. Is it, uh, is yes, it, it is. Okay. Hey, Liz. While you're busy exploring Snack Tooth, I thought you might want to see how our town is coming together. I know you'll see it when you come back, but isn't it fun to watch a work in progress? Hey, Ega Bro! I was just asking Snorpy where we should put your crib! Oh, I don't know. I think anywhere would be fine, really. Nonsense! I'm looking to create the optimum tactical advantage here. Which direction does Lisbeth face when sleeping, and does she keep her <laughs> eyes open? Or, uh, you'd have to ask Liz? But Lisbeth's gone, dog! We can't wait for her to come back! We need a decision now! Sounds like a job for Bilbo! I think Liz would want a place close to everybody. Chandler, and Snorpy, we're gonna put Liz and Egg's house right at the heart of town. We are, are we? And who exactly put you in charge? Uh, Lizbert did? Um, weren't you at the meeting? Hmm, I don't recall that part. Every 
everybody keeps forgetting that I'm kind of in charge. There's got to be some way I can remind them. I'm sure you'll think of something. Oh, and speaking of my mayoral duties, I've been trying to come up with a name for our town. What do you think of Lisbertalia? Absolutely not! <laughs> Bafaka, you ruined the moment! No taking pictures of me when I'm watching these movies. What did I just say? What's the most disgusting thing I can turn you into? Be a weenie! 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 Weenie. There, that'll do. Do I know the democracy? There's no pictures of the butt. Buttmocracy. Yeah, you know what? That's good. We're gonna have a buttmocracy. Snacktooth. Wait, that's it though? That's it? That must be the secret ending, isn't it? To be honest, I preferred the original ending I got. I preferred the original ending I got to that one. Because that's when it reveals that, uh, like, the, the et tu, like, they, they said something in Latin about, like, bug snacks, like, you are what you eat or something like including the bug snacks and it's revealed that the editor is in on it and she uh that's why she didn't want you to go to that island because it was harboring some kind of secret there might be a bug snacks too i could see that maybe i would definitely do i honestly i would have preferred a bigger expansion that was paid than the small free expansion i mean it was great it was good but i would have happily paid money for something larger because i do love this game and i would like to see more the original ending had a bigger impact, I agree. But that is going to be it for the Bug Snacks Big Snacks DLC content. I absolutely loved it. It was amazing. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like. It helps out a lot. And comment what your favorite Bug Snacks is. Bye bye